What's going on, Tiger Tran Clan? Today, it is complete. The wall, the upgrades, it has all come to fruition. We finally have a three-tiered defense of a base completely constructed with decent, well, at least one crossbow over here. We're going to build some more. We've been cranking out iron plates. It's just taking time. This game has taken so long to get a, a really highly functioning base to come online because we literally have just been a, a combat, like attack over and over and over. And it hasn't been very long since that last video. Basically, all I did was complete this wall and maybe was playing for five minutes. And then, boom, another horde of raptors are attacking me. So we are going to have our boy Blend, who has that fat stats. We're going to have him shoot this fool right in the face. Oh, and we need everyone to go on passive. Ah. Uh, no, Quan. Oh, I guess Quan could actually be the one who repairs. I don't mind you doing that, bruh. Buy some time while Blend shoots some fools in the back. Um. work dude so he's a hundred percent accuracy now he's a straight up machine dude he punishes he's the straight up punisher of anyone who attacks our base thankfully our engineering skill uh, this is making our engineering skill up so i do not mind this at all while blend does straight up work their spinal cords blah 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 won't be oh gosh this this thing may freak me out for a second i was like is some someone shooting me with magic spells or something some energy weapons hitting me to have Kang come over here and work this bow for me and then we are gonna have Valak come over here and work this one so we did hit a quick save and then ooh, we got plants let's go son get up here and you'll work this third one because the, the gate is probably pretty soon about to fall so we're gonna have you guys all bop over here just to keep them out of harm's way, that is a lot of raptors. And right now, these fools can still hit us real hard. Dang, dude. The, the giant man, dude, he's so injured. I, I kind of actually just want you to sleep, bro. Can you actually do that for me? Wait, is Blend still doing work over there? Wait, are you still doing work, Blend? Blend. Maybe it's because I took him off job. Maybe that caused him to bug out a bit. Yeah, shoot that fool, man. Yeah, punish these fools for coming close to us. Can't be here. This ain't your home. This is my home, son. All day, er day, my home. You don't belong here. Okay, so it looks like I can't. All right, bros. Everyone come upstairs so I can easily equip you onto a crossbow. Oh, you know what would fix the crossbows? If you just had them return to neutral position after they were used. The easiest fix on the planet. It's just the fact that they stay rotated 180 degrees, so that way you can't click on them. Too broken. For my likings. So we are going to close you, since this raptor's getting pretty close. And let's make it rain hot death, son. The hottest of hot death. Blah, 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 Make them pay. Make them, make them, make them pay. And this is so good. Now that we finally have a high-level crossbow bolt guy right here, this is this is straight up heaven because I think this is going to cause the aggro when they get kind of caught in the front of our gate because the, the AI thinks this is like, I don't know, maybe people don't create multi-tiered gates or they haven't created code for that. Oh, my gosh. Look at this death, dude. Oh, my goodness. Do you remember in the early videos when it took... 30 minutes to kill a group of these guys because their accuracy was turds and not only that they could just eat through our gates at the speed of light oh my gosh i'm so happy i'm so happy so happy let's go let's pwn these fools let's show them who we are we're gonna crank it all day all day and all night all right so now they will go and repair this gate you know, to be honest, I might just upgrade it now. Because 
I think we have five building materials. I'd be surprised if we didn't. And then we'll take our boy Quan. Nobody's injured, which is amazing. And we're going to go out here and skin these fools. Alive. Kang, what are you up to, bro? Oh, you didn't get the job key. And then, well, we got a lot of engineers. They should just bop out there and do it. But let's let us get all these juicy leather. Because we finally have a leather crafting station up and operational, which is huge. Is that all of them? I don't want there to be like a sneaky snake one, like hiding underneath all of his friends. Dang, look at that, dude. Look at all those bolts in their body, man. I love it. It totally looks like there's like a fourth one hidden in here. There he is. You can't escape from judgment. Judgment. We are the Terminators. We are the Arnolds, y'all. Get out of these bodies. Cool, cool. This is great, dude. And then they're already cracking up the upgraded tower. Not tower. The upgraded gate, which has five additional health. Can't go wrong there. Bam. Let's stack this. Throw our leather in here for now. Oh, you know, I should just create a... And I might have it already, now that I think about it. A leather storage? Did I ever build that? Give a loon. What is this? Weapon stand? Okay. Uh, we got fabric storage. I just realized we need to make K10 uh, haul to here. After she crafts them delicious clubs. She's getting her skill up. It's going to be awesome. It takes a while, but hey, what are you going to do? You know, let me check one thing real quick. Ah. Well, as long as we pay attention to the front gate at the same time. I'm just wondering, does anyone just have good weapon crafting skill just off the badge? I mean, she's up to five. That's good. She started at one. Dude, our laboring is, is climbing, which is great. So nobody... I guess the giant had a little bit of weapon crafting talent, but nothing too huge. I wonder if you can recruit weaponsmiths, and I've never found them. That'd be cool if you could, though, but I don't think you can. Oh, it looks like Hobbs is going to be our armor crafter. Uh, so, you know, we have, oh, we have a loon. With this one, we need leather crafting next. So we haven't got leather. I think, to be honest, that's new. I think we just actually researched it. So let us look real quick. Crafting. Yes, we just did. Leather tanning. So this is importante. Can we fit this over here? Perfection. I just don't want it to block the stairs. Because that would be annoying. Yeah, I don't think it will. Just takes three iron plates. Okay, cool. So then we have leather armor crafting, which we'll put upstairs. Right above it. Because I think they'll just naturally... Because, like, the way the level is, I think it'll just naturally uh, pop up there. Like, you could just naturally grab the items from there and put it, bring it up to the top. Dude, this is like the one weird song of this game that is like insanely loud. Good thing, all right. I did turn it down for the recording because I saw it in one of my videos and I was like, dang, boy, why is this song like 80 times louder than the rest of the audio files or the song files? Wait, is Emerita, is Emerita working this job or what? Was I wrong about the number of uh, supplies we had? No, we got three over here. How many we got in the machine? Maybe she had run over and grabbed some. No, because she didn't have any in her inventory. I don't know. All right, well, anyways, we're close. Let's, uh, once again, we're going to look around, see if we had any more random building supplies that were kind of just on the ground. Right here, we're building copper. I totally, oh, we do. I'm right here. Need that. Um, who's our, who's our builder? Hobbs is one of them. Dang, dude, look how fast Quan is, dude. He's just, he's like Hussein Bolt over there. I should have, Quan Bolt, son of Hussein. All right, we just need one more building supply. Oh, this is so glorious. Get it, Quan. Get it, get it, get it, Quan. What, what? Let's do this. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. yeah. Give this to... Come on. 
Come on with it. Come on with it. Yeah, there it is. There it is. There it is. Fat new gate coming up. I don't know what this does, though, to be honest. Like, I don't know what having, like, a... Uh, I know it, it said on the tooltip that it goes up in health by 5. Because it used to have 15. So, is that, like, 500 more HP? I don't know what 5 means in building durability. But, I mean, it, it seems like they have to do a lot of damage to a gate before they can get him, though. That's at least what I've seen. You know what I'm wondering is if I put a turret up here... Could they shoot backwards into their backs? Like, would this just be, like, the ultimate kill spot is what I'm kind of wondering. I think it probably would be. So, we are now going to... Oh, door condition 30. Okay. Dang, dude. Yeah, because these are 15. So, it actually doubles the HP of these gates. Nothing to scoff at by any stretch of the imagination. You know how this has, like, a hole in it? I wonder what happened if you put, like, crossbows through here. You think they could shoot through the door? That'd be so dope if they could. Man, our fallback position. I mean, I probably won't res re uh, take off these crossbows just in case we ever need a heavy fallback position. But, man, this is... is this is nostalgia town, dude. The amount of defense that we got down in here is next next level insanity. Uh, how come I told I told the giant to stay in here and rest up because he is busted, dude. Straight up busted. So let's hope that he just continues to sleep. Sometimes the sleep mechanic in this game is pretty bugged. I mean, I turned off his jobs. He's on passive. Um, hopefully that does something to quell his thirst for running around all right how many so okay good we do have a ton of people focused on making plates right now wait do we what like where do they go does this guy snow he's on iron operating the iron resource operating the machine wait iron resource machine wait he has two of the same i'm so confused oh is he trying to get food or something He's engineering. Oh, that's right. We had put some people on engineering because we were getting trolled, dude. Because we had to repair our gates so much, I took half of my workforce and put them as engineering. Like, please, just repair the gates before you do anything. We just need to be able to survive. Because we were literally in, like, 100% pure survival mode. It was brutal. So what's Quan up to? He's engineering as well. I'm okay. To be honest, I'm okay with just engine like Emeretta being our main engineer for now. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Perfect. So the question for me is, do we want to take Quan and to have him take some of the goods in the morning? I mean, it's pretty late right now, but do we want him to take some of the goods and start selling them, or do we do we just want to wait for uh, caravans? To be honest, I would like to soak up some of that dried meat that might have potentially popped up. So, mm. oh good, the boy uh, Rain, he's still, he's actually laying down and sleeping. So does it tell you anywhere where it says what the bonus healing is? Doesn't look like it. I could have swore, I think it's like a 6x modifier if I remember correctly. So, toughness, HPKO. <laughs> so, you can see my wife in the back corner here. Whoop. Yeah, it's all good. You can sit. She likes watching while I record. She's cute. Look what she got me for Valentine's Day. It's a kid. I put the little panda climbing on a glass full of flowers. She's adorbs. Amazing waifu. Right over there. Aw, oh, yeah. So, we, right now, man, look at this. We're getting those iron plates for days, which is great. That means we're making money. And K10 right now is... What are you doing? She must have ran out of iron plates to... But she did make this iron club. Oh my gosh. It tells her 271. 
but look at that damage output dude 0.04 could you imagine attempting to fight with that that is like the the butt cheeks of butt cheek weapons dude oh man i wonder if i should have put those are are the weapon places in here instead uh the weapon um cabinets because it's going to be hard to use those weapon cabinets from that distance but once again if we just take one person i just you know what i mean i'm just thinking about like minimizing shenanigans we definitely need to probably once we have the gates upgraded all three of them we'll probably build another iron refinery place so that way we can just really start to crank out iron plates because after we have double gates upgraded to be honest it's not going to be a big deal uh like building materials wise i mean it'll be nice to sit on you know maybe 50 just in case we ever want to build like a bigger house later on because this our crafting house is filling up real quick but what we need to really do is just get a ton of research book go into tier three keep on having our people uh you know making skins makes basically have one guy who's an armor expert one person who is a blade expert because if you can make master quality armor the the ac is absolutely insane 100 percent worth it but right now iron plates man is is where it's at we are struggling to get iron plates you know to be honest we'll we'll do it i'm gonna i'm gonna set it up just because i want them to can we make a tier two though so oh we can make a tier two so this, this is the one that just uses uh power okay how massive this thing is dude all right let's put this in this corner here oh zitch my man in my way but in my way but but if we put it right here as well i just want to keep it far enough from the walls just in case we ever do want to upgrade those to tier two walls i think this is still within range to where this will definitely be in range if we do it like this bam confirm Yeah, dude, it's just plates. We got three people laboring away, though, on plates. You know, I kind of almost want to put this... Oh, it's empty. Iron Club. I'm going to... I'm just going to pause this real quick. Just because if we can just get more iron plates online, that's what it's all about. We're going to jack up the speed for a hot minute. So that way they just keep on keeping on. All right. How much wheat do we have these days? Oh, we almost have our next batch of crops let's go the first time in years oh i am so glad i just checked that gate because look at who's out here being turds an enormous horde of raptors all right so got to get our boy blend up here blend is the machine who does epic damage we're gonna put him on this one uh juan is also really good so we're gonna put him on that one and then I think the rest of them will come over here and just engineer the door who have engineering skill. To be honest, this gate is pretty beefy, dude. Oh, gosh, don't hit K10. She, like, phased through the door. All right, we're hitting that save button just in case something janky happens here. She just broke the time-space continuum. Good. Emerald is getting over here. This is really good skill as well. Blend is a straight-up machine with 100% accuracy now because his turret skills are through the roof, which is huge. Where's other boy? Where you at, man? You slow? No, Quan's fast, dude. He's the Flash. All right. Okay, some of Zitch is coming over to help as well. I wonder how fast they're repairing versus how fast this thing is taking damage. But we definitely need these guys to fall back behind this wall. So let's do that now. Turn off their jobs. Tell them to run over here and get to Tier 1. We're going to have the Rake wake up. Because he probably is uninjured enough to where he has all of his speed back. Yeah, perfect. Wait, is Quan doing work over here? Oh, this isn't actually done. Oh, okay, but we did have the plates. Dude, it's so dark. I, j I just read a tooltip saying that darkness in decreases your effectiveness of using machines. So we're also going to put up some lights here pretty soon. So we're going to take everybody. We're going to turn off their jobs. And as they run over here, we're going to put them on them 
put them on them sexy bows. Luca. Line them up. Put them down. I wonder if the the AI moves slower at nighttime. Why are you guys not shooting, though? Bruh. Shoot this fool. He's the enemy of the nation. You want <laughs> and nothing to do with them. They are evil. They are evil incarnate. And they must die with extreme prejudice. They are some creepy looking creatures, though. Could you imagine seeing that, like, in real life? Some freaky beast like that? So it does. Is Blunt get some good shots over here? I love when he can even uh, go higher than this. Because this gate's not even closed. Uh, what? <laughs> Alright, so we will have these guys shoot at, and we'll have you guys shoot at the one behind him. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, there we go. I think the AI was bugging out for a second. I don't know why it was. Wait, what if I close this door? Do you think they'll run over here and try to punch it? Instead of trying to attempt to path? Yeah, yeah, okay, good. This is working, good. So he is attempting to punch the door, which is not bad at all. Because I would rather them, you know, attempt to punch the door and me be able to throw a wooden pole to death than them just be bugging me. These probably have some people crunking away at work. I think they're probably fine doing that. Let's go on a few, though. Uh, let's pull them back over here. Yeah, get lit up, son. Dang, look how many raptors there are, dude. I mean, we killed a bunch of them. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And we've killed these two here. Oh my gosh, man. This game. It's like, how how would you ever win against this if you didn't have somewhat of a base established? I guess you couldn't. You'd be hiding in the desert just trying to hold on for your life. Which is basically, I was this swamp, man. So brutal. I'm trying to think if there's a harder biome than this. I would think the cannibal area would be pretty difficult because they would hit you with swarms and if, once again, you couldn't get crossbows online, you'd be just fodder. Is Ruka sensei firing? I do not know why they do this. There we go. Get back on. I have no idea why they'll just be like, eh, I'm going to get off the objective and we don't need to defend our base. I enjoy getting eaten by raptors. <laughs> You're dropping the ball, man. All right. So once again, what if we close this gate here? Maybe they'll aggro and attempt to attack it. I wonder if it's just if the bow rotates to a point to where it's like unusable. We really need to get a bow over here, though. That's got to be like priority number one. Like, I wonder if this gets a good, clear shot over here, but it doesn't look like this one does, so I don't think this one would either. Where's this one shooting, though? It actually doesn't look like he is shooting. Oh, because you know what? This is so strange. I So I thought they were smart enough to aim for the ones that are, you know, in their kill box when someone else isn't, but it doesn't look actually like they are smart enough to do that, which is a bummer. Like, would you... Ah! Uh, no. But I think if I tell him to go and jump on the objective, then he aims at someone he can hit, right? No. <laughs> Alright. I guess I just have to be Manuel McGee over here. <gasps> what is this? Are these slavers? They are slavers. Ah, uh, dang it. Wait, is this gate closed? No, it's open. Close this unlocked. Oh, no. This is not public. This is locked. Are they going to see us? I think they might. Oh, they're actually coming in, these little turds. Alright. We're going to have Blend pop back up here. Maybe 
can't get to that one, but maybe you at least can get to this one. Light him up, light him up. Holy moly. Gosh, dude. But look at this game, dude. They spawned like 15 to 20 raptors on us, only then to have another horde of banditos come of the slave mongers. Oh, no, the slave mongers pulled out. Okay, that's good. So they didn't, they couldn't end up seeing us in their uniforms because we made our base private and closed all the gates. To be honest, I would have liked their juicy loot, but at the same time, I don't like the fact that two of our gates are already destroyed. And these guys are pressing into this last gate, and it's probably, they might destroy it, but eh, most likely not. I don't, I don't like the fight of th the chance of them punching in hard, and then I guess we still have one more door, but ugh, it's just it's just pushing it. But we got him, we got him, boys, we got him. All right, we're gonna leave them on passive. We're gonna put them on their jobs. Once again, if you just tell them to move, then they get back to work. I think Kang has just been, yeah, dude, he's been working on the railroad all day and night. But man, that's gonna do it for this video. I think we dodged a bullet by not having to fight slave mongers on top of raptors though i wish the raptors would attack the slave mongers that'd be nice but you can't have it all man you can't have it all at least we have our life an awesome base set up only two gates fell which makes me even want to create a fourth gate at some point just to you know stay safe and we got a bunch of leather which is gigantic because this will make it so we can craft that armor for days because you can actually make these rice picker hats I don't know if they put any other uh, any other kits in the game yet, or better. Like, I feel like armor was the last thing they were putting in, where weapons are pretty flushed out. But man, we look at all this delicious fur. We probably need a corpse burner, dude. I, I really, I don't mind because it's supposed to attract animals, but the animals I want them to attract are wolves, dude. Or, go well, goats are mainly corpses, right? That'd be awesome, because wolves actually drop meat, which is fantastic. I would love that extra food, you know what I'm saying? But that's going to do it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. I definitely am having a blast defending this base and building, finally, an empire of awesome. And soon we're going to be crafting high-quality weapons, which is going to be incredible. So we can make that fat loot, get those research books, have huge food infrastructure. Oh, it's finally getting to the place to where I don't feel like a... Like a like an ant in a world of humans just bashing your face all day long. Because that's basically what we were when we had one... We had basically all our skills were one. But now looking on us, man, we're moving on up in the world. I mean, Quan always started with decent stats, but he's already up to 46 defense. Dang, boy. Oh, he's got his block on, though. But we're moving on up in the world. All right, guys, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and let me know in the comments. And if you're new, think about hitting that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys next time.